All right, let's look at the Japanese method of multiplying fractions. Now, this is 2 over 3 multiplied by 2 over 5. Now, the first thing for us to do here is to draw a box. Simply draw a box like this. And what do we do there? Because of this 3 here, we are going to share the box into 3 parts. And then after sharing the box into 3 parts, then we select, because of the 2 up here, we select 2 of the parts. So I'm going to select 2 parts now. So I have selected 2 of the 3 parts because we have 2 over 3 there. Then now, the next thing for us to do is to go to the next number, 5. Because of this 5 here, we have used this 3 here, we have used vertical lines to divide into 3 parts. Now I'm going to use horizontal line to divide this box into 5 parts because of this 5 here. So I divide into 5 parts. That is 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 5. So that is five parts for you. So one part, two, three, four, and then five parts. Now, because of the two here, out of these five parts, two, we are going to select two of them. So let me use vertical lines now to select two of them. So I'm selecting two of them. So out of the five parts, I've selected two. This part is one and this part is two. Now, for us to get our final answer, what do you do? You pick the part that intersects where the two up here that we selected intersect with the two up here that was selected. So, you agree with me that it is where these horizontal lines meet these vertical lines. So, these are the four boxes where they meet. So, because of that, we take these four boxes and so we're going to say our final answer is 4. Then all divided by the total number of boxes. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. We have 15 boxes. So that gives us our final answer as 4 over 15. Hope you enjoyed this special method. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.